On today's video, I'm going to show you an awesome productivity tip if you happen to use a Mac that will help you save you hours of time every single week. Hi everybody, it's Jason Everett from Business Refuel and welcome to my office. I'm going to give you some productivity tips today that if you use a laptop uh, for your day-to-day -day activity and specifically if you use a Mac, they're going to help accelerate your success behind your desktop every single day. I learned this tip a couple of years ago and I have not looked back and everybody I've ever taught it to just says thank you so much because it changes your level of productivity. So if you've ever struggled where you, you're trying to use, you know, uh, you're trying to read something off one screen and type it on another and you, you just can't figure out how to do it and you end up using some paper or another device or something like that, this is the perfect solution for you. You're gonna get a lot of value out of this and in fact, I'm gonna multiply your, your productivity by sometimes 18 uh, 18 times, and I'll show you what I mean by 18 times here in just a second. So come with me, check out my desktop, and I'll show you a little bit about it. First of all, you can see my setup. I've got two screens. I've got my laptop screen and my main monitor screen. I'm just using a VGA connector that just hooks the two together. So you can see them. You don't have to use another Apple product. A lot of people think you do, but you don't. Um, and also, I have a separate keyboard and Magic Trackpad because I have my laptop elevated, so it's at my eye level, so I'm not straining as I'm going through the day. Anyway, a couple just basic things in there. Now, because I have two desktops, you'll notice it's the same computer, but it's kind of like I'm running two at once. I have information on one and information on the other. One of my favorite configurations I like to use is email on the left side, calendar on the right side. It's a great way for me to make sure that I have access to all the information that I need at just a very quick glance. Another configuration I like to use is when I open up my Skype on the left side and I actually open up an internet browser on the right. Now what's cool about that, and you might go, oh my gosh, how did you just change all those things? Well, there's a bunch of ways to do it, but I'm going to show you one of the easier ones is if I just uh, do a quick lift with my mouse, and you do have to turn that on in your settings section. If you want information on that, message me, I'll tell you. Uh, but as you can tell, I actually have multiple now desktops instead of screens that are open up here at the top of my screen. In fact, that's why I said you said where I said you'd be 18 times more productive. Uh, you can actually have up to you know 18, you can have 20, you can have way more screens open if you want. Now, if you're the type of person that loves organization, uh, to me, this is a very productive tip because I can handle massive amounts of information all at the same time. Uh, and so what was really good about this is if you want to just flip to a blank screen, boom, I'm right to my blank screen, got access to anything on my desktop. If I want to open up a document and continue to work on it from where I left off, boom, it's right there in front of me. And again, I can switch back and forth either on the screens by themselves into what it is that I need to do, or I can, again, go do that quick little uh, four-finger lift move and get access to all the different desktops. So while I'm in here, because I'm mentioning it, go ahead, like us on Facebook. If you don't like us already, give us a like on Facebook. You'll get other great tips like this that'll help you increase your productivity level and the strategy in which that you're working. So let me put it this way. The reason why I like this setup is because you can do a lot more without having to close and open programs. Believe it or not, the amount of time you spend closing and opening programs can be upwards of an hour every single week. And I don't know about you, but I'd sure like to have at least an hour of my time back. So while you're sitting there, can you get the information to move in a direction that you don't have to wait for programs to open? Man, that's the worst, you're waiting for programs to open. So if you like this video, give the video a like, comment below what was the tip that you didn't know, or if the whole thing is there uh, and you've never heard it before, just let me know in the comment section below. And if you want better instructions, on how to do one of those things. Uh, also write in the comments and I'll give you another detailed video that'll show you how to do it. Until then, this has been Jason Everett from Business Refuel. Go on and check out our page at facebook.com slash businessrefuel for more great tips like this. And I hope to see you uh, in another video like this really soon. Take care.